Hello, my name is Tyler Erickson from Top Notch Taxidermy and today I'm going to show you how to skin a mallard and then we're going to go through and flesh it, mount it, uh, basically take it from start to finish. So I hope you enjoy this video and um, can learn something. I'll try to go kind of slow so you can pick it up. Get it back on my bird here. What I've got here is a nice uh, late season mallard. Uh, it looks kind of shot up and nasty in this video, but that's just because it's it's been soaking in water <clears throat> to help thaw it out quicker, and uh, all these feathers will fluff back out. And it's actually a really it'll be a really nice bird here. So it doesn't look great now, but it's just because it's wetted down. Uh, but one thing you want to look for. <coughs> And I have a little bit of a cold, so excuse me while I talk. But one thing you want to look for in birds is pin feathers. Um, where the feathers go into the skin, they should have a real small white feather tip that goes in all over the bird. If you see a more of a gray, a thicker, waxy, straw-like covering on the ends of the feathers, these are known as pin feathers and they will not uh, stay in the skin as good. They're basically undeveloped or unmatured feathers. Um, the easiest way to kind of learn to tell the difference between pin feathers and mature feathers would be <coughs> to take a bird from early season, you know, maybe on like opener or the first week or two of season if you shoot a duck or a pheasant. Throw that bird in your freezer label it, throw it in your freezer as an early season bird. Don't plan on mounting it, but <clears throat> later in the year, say mid-November or late October or December, the later you can get the birds, the better. They're going to be more mature, they're going to have more color, and their feathers are going to be firmly stuck in the skin. But thaw both of those birds out, take a late season bird and an early season bird and lay them side by side and then just pull the feathers back and look at the very bases of the feathers where they go into the body. And you'll be able to sit, see real easy what a pin feather bird looks like compared to a good one. That's important to know when you're looking at customer birds. I never, never take in a bird that isn't mature, isn't